Tiofan is currently working in many provinces, working on peace building activities through local partners, through different sources of funding. So with this funding, with the UN Peace Building Fund, we chose to go to Tanganyika because there's been this long-standing conflict, a history of uh, tensions between these two groups of the Dwa and the Bantu, and we decided that's where we could make a real impact as Tier Fund. The <laughs> ni mtu fulani alizokuwa sana hii fujo me akukua mangasi tunakimbia tunarudia tunakimbia tunarudia sisi tulikimbia ni vita entre toi bantu na bantu groupe ma yango kulipotea watu na vitu vya watu viliharibika sana akukua maendeleo sami hivi na nabeba inchi ya benyewe mumpaka ni humu na achi na ingia kwa mwinjangu mwinjangu naye anakuwa hii inchi si yako ni yangu bukomfe pale Ya na beba bake na mi bake tunapikana tunapikana kisha pale tunaumizana damu inafuani ni ina inatoka pale bana kosa nguvu bana pika benjabu selon le titre qui a été mené par Tia Fund en 2021 l'étude de base sur l'analyse du contexte au fait local ici à Nyonzo euh, elle a prouvé l'étude a prouvé que les raisons des conflits ou des violences qui ont été euh, qui ont eu lieu dans les années 2016 à 2018 Uh, avait uh, des grandes uh, des grandes préoccupations ou des grands des grands des grands points et le premier était au fait la discrimination uh, basée sur le genre et l'ethnie ifasi eni koi iko mzozo sana huyu mzozo ni wanini ni wao huyu mwamba kongolo mwamba kongolo ni mwen kuingililia mu parcelle akabo ya delabati anakuya anapanda ipo tenge anakuya anapanda china huyu mungazi anapanda na ule mungazi kisha na ile orange iko kule nikamaonesha hapana mpandio wako naenda mubaya unaangililia wapi unaangililia mpango yangu unaiwa na kuongea kwa mwanaume na kwa mwanamke biko tofauti tukabakia pale tulikuwa ni fuja sana nikabeba watoto yangu nikibapeleka kwa nduku yangu yena kwa kabeba bake basifike kwangu mimi na mimi wangu basifike kwake tukaikala kweli pale palileta fuja kwa bami And so one of the the causes of conflict over many years is around land and who owns the land. So being able to have a formal system of who owns what is being able to resolve conflicts for the long term. Uliona Kongo sinatifu anakuya. Kutoonesha gisi ya kutatua mizozo ya mipaka ya mashamba, mizozo ya mipaka ya maparcel, kaanza kufundisha watu na kubakaribisha entre watu na bantu kuikala fuashi moya nakubaletea majifunzo mbalimbali mbali. neno nyanyi inatuleta hapa ni neno yetu vile vile tunaingiaka mubikao kwa sababu ya kujenga amani ya kudumu furaha amani esesenjo alitwita kwa mwana tia found akatufundisha na njo ule ufahamu na mimi nilipata na mimi shibaki tena nao mimi moya naenda naimiza watu wengine wenzangu ndani ya mungiti sasa tunafanyaka dialogue communauté tunaongeaka kuhusu amani amani ya kudumu na mafundisho hayo watu wenyewe wanaendelea tena kuipatanisha kwa sababu paka sasa hivi tuko naongea kunakuwa na mabadiliko hatukuwa kana kula pamoja lakini kupitia ile mafundisho leo hii chakula ikoonekana na mtu na mtu tunakata fashi moja wa champion de peo alikuwa beko ni tufundisha gishi ya mwikaji wa gishi ya kutala mwingine wetu mafundisho yabo ni tuingia kati ya bantu na batua tulikuwa basukani batatu tulikuwa na fia inchi tulikuwa na fujo depuwe ba muyomba nazani bonjo alikuwa kuisa makelele hapa na mwenyewe chef de groupe alikuwa anashindwa pale fasi 
me kwa siku hii sasa tunaanza hisi pamoja na ile inchi kabakia ku mikono yangu ni peke yako nasema ni kuna kumara na mtu tangia mudari upite uyu wa SS bana kwa bien batu na ba, na batua bana kwa nasikilizana tunakuwa nalia pamoja tunakuwa naenda pa mai siku okea pamoja tunakuwa msikilizana Ongane jatife na bati bakiesa baka kuya kufa nini kuitwa moa huyu mzozo wa mpango baka tusikilizisha baka tuweka fasi moya na kabu ya dela bati na mwamba kongolo baka amua sema hapana huyu mwamba kongolo ni mwe kuingililia wapi ni mwe kuingililia mpango ya kabu ya dela bati washa 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 Cette approche qu'on utilise de travailler avec les communautés locales, c'est une approche efficace parce que nous renforçons les communautés locales à capacité et après maintenant on les déploie au terrain. Et pour renforcer ces équipes, nous faisons recours aux agronomes, les agronomes du groupement, les agronomes du secteur. C'est eux qui font ce travail ici. Comme vous pouvez le constater dans l'équipe ici, il y a des agronomes, il y a aussi des enseignants. Il y a aussi euh, donc les, 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 les gens qui sont de, de, du village et c'est le fait qu'ils sont renforcés à, à capacité et que ça fait partie aussi de leur travail quotidien, les mesurages des champs et ainsi de suite. On vient maintenant, on leur apprend comment euh, utiliser euh, les outils des nouvelles technologies. Les cartes sont produites, les croquis des parcelles et que les voisins sont d'accord sur les limites. Ça, c'est un moyen efficace déjà de prévenir Karibuni tena wa ndugu wasikilizaji wa Radio RCK. Kumkono wangu wa kushoto nakuwa na mgeni mwenye tuko naye pamoya dada Jambo naweza kujitaja. Mjambo wa ndugu wasikilizaji wa penzi, mimi ni dada Rachel. Ndani ya kipindi yetu Eco Artisan de Pe. Kipindi kinaendeshwa kuniaba ya Muradi Artisan de Pe. Muradi unaendeshwa na shirika tatu. Sia found SSC na Kongo Initiative. Leo tutaongelea njia mbalimbali ya kutatua mzozo wa Hii misho yuko na nisaidia kupitia hali ya mizozo yenyewe tuko nayo leo. Inanisaidia na mi leo natoka kwa mashamba tunatengeneza mupaka na jirani wangu mwenyewe alikuwa na leo hii. Tukongwa na fa bitu mzuri ya kukataza mzozo, ya kukata parcelle mzuri, ya kukata inti mzuri. Sultani kwa sultani bana kosana kongwa na kwenda kuangalia ni hivi ni hivi ni hivi kongwa si anakuwa saka kadastre shatatosha mikanda Tefund we work with local partners to be able to access communities but also to be able to build on the strengths and the capacities that they have already so we're currently working with Congo Initiative which has a lot of experience in land reform and a lot of experience doing this project elsewhere Wakati tumizozo ilimalisha kanyo tunasama, kumbe tulime hata mashamba. Wakati tunapata mavuno, kanti ilisazi mama apate vero maya akalanga, mama mutu wa vero akalanga, mama mtu vero akalanga. Bila tofauti fulani. Chia faundi, alitufanizia oneri kabambi. Alitusaidia misaada, mambego ya kupanda. Alitusaidia kalanga, alitusaidia miindi, alitusaidia miti ya miogo, alitusaidia pesa ya kulimisha na mashamba alitusaidia mashete ma, ma alitusaidia mashoka na majembe ndio bifai benye chefa onda alitusaidia na marato project we had two local partners one of whom was the Iglesia de Cristo Congo so it's an umbrella church for the Protestant churches in Congo and we worked with them because we fully believe that churches and faith leaders have an essential role to play in peace building we believe that faith leaders are trusted and respected in their communities and they can also play a role to resolve conflicts that are ongoing so we involved faith leaders in the dialogues but also in being able to spread messages of peace within their churches Tazama ni vema na ya kupendeza sana kwa ndugu kukaa pamoja kwa umoja ni kama mafuta ya dunia ya juu ya kichwa. Mimi kama mchungaji Abedi ninafurahia pamoja na wapastori wenzangu wote 
kwa kufurahikiwa mafundisho kama na ileta TFNT kusaidia namna gani watu wa nyuzu watapata neema ndani ya mioyo yao ili tujue kuendelea mzuri na teritori yetu ya nyuzu pia tufunze watu mu makanisa watu waeleo namna gani tutaishi vizuri ndani ya teritori yetu ya nyuzu hapo mafundisho ni tuingia sana hapa kwangu wa vijana weka nejitoa sana kwa kuendesha ile mradi wetu hatuwezi kuacha vijana wataendelea mie etanke chef mimi itakuwa ni majifunzo tu kujifunza kila wakati na watoto yangu na kuanza kuendelesha kutatua mizozo mbalimbali mbali. eh. siwezi kubachililia hapana kwa sababu president wa sefer ni mi chef ninaofahamu kusema hii muradi hata inafika mwisho sisi peke tutabakia tunaendelea vile vile community yote mbili pamoja tunajimiza tunajisensibilize tuna kama kuna tukia mizozo tunabakia fashu moya na tunaitatua na inasikilika na tunaendelea kuishi katika amani pale hata cha founder anarudia sisi tutabakia vile vile mu relation tutabakia mu collaboration tunatumika pamoja vile vile bafami tu na bafami bantu kwa sipo makelele fulani tutalima tu mashamba yetu na kuendelea the project has had a massive impact on people's lives people who never used to come together never be able to work together or eat together are now coming together and sharing life together so what we've seen is these groups that for many years have been apart there have been killings and reprisal killings on on either side but now communities are coming together families are coming together and being able to work together in the field as i said we had these communal gardens so people diverse groups coming together and growing crops together what we have done through this project is so seeds of change that seeds of transformation that will last for many years is it enough there's still conflicts there's still more we can do but i fully believe in the peace champions that we've put in place the local committees that are there that they will be able to have a sustainable change over many years to come